Good afternoon and welcome to the HPMA Awards 2020. Thanks for joining us this afternoon and I hope you've all sat comfortably with a glass of bubbles in your hand or a cup of tea maybe. I'm here today to announce the award for cross-sector working which is sponsored by the University of Bradford. My name is Joanne Marshall and I'm Director of People and Campus Services for the University of Bradford. The nominees for the cross-sector working HPMA 2020 Award, sponsored by the University of Bradford, are as follows. Black Country Partnerships Trust for internships for individuals with disabilities. Greater Manchester Health and Social Care Partnership for Greater Manchester's Blended Roles Approach in a Neighbourhood. And East and North Hertfordshire NHS Trust for Bank Share Collaborative Working Project. Good luck to all three finalists. I'm Emma Evans, I'm an Administration Manager with Black Country Healthcare NHS Foundation Trust. We are now entering the third year of uh, our initiative. We started this because as a trust we felt we could provide plenty of opportunities for students with learning disabilities to gain work experience in the workplace. We worked closely with a local school, provided job descriptions for the school in admin and catering and then the school matched the students for us. Within the job description, we wanted to look at areas where the students were capable of achieving and to develop more skills throughout their experience with us. From talking to parents and the feedback we've had, the students have really enjoyed their time with the Trust and gained valuable life skills. To be nominated for this award is a real honour and I really mean that. I'm hoping that this raises the profile and employers take the initiative to provide work experience in the workplace and to create opportunities for employment for people with learning disabilities. I'm hoping that this changes ways of thinking in recruitment and from experience know that the difference that this makes to individuals. Hi, I'm Jo Finnerty and I'm the Workforce Lead for Adult Social Care at the Greater Manchester Health and Social Care Partnership. Hello, I'm Dave Wilson. Uh, I work for Thameside Council on the Adult Social Care Commissioning Team and I'm Lead for the Transformation of Home Care in the Borough. Hi, I'm Paula Bell. I'm District Nurse Team Lead for the Gents in Charleston locality working within Thameside and Glossop. Our project was around creating neighbourhood-based blended roles in the Thameside Borough. The project included district nurses and two of our service care providers within the locality. And we were looking at low level healthcare tasks and the first one we looked at was pressure area care. Um, this has been a really lovely exciting piece of work for us, not least because it takes uh, integration to that next level involving uh, our independence um, providers partners as well uh, and that's been really important to it to us really because of that historically that them and us thing that's always existed and this brings providers into the uh, uh, as a team member and it's just felt really lovely. Um, certainly for, from a, a patient perspective the the project that we've we've um, completed over in Thameside has had a brilliant um, outcomes for the patients and and staff itself. It's streamlined um, the the work that we do was from a service provider and a district nurse perspective, um, providing more individualised outcomes for patients. Hi, I'm Paul Degama. I'm Chief People Officer at West Hearts NHS Hospitals Trust. I'm also the chair of the Hearts and Beds agency and bank um, um, consortium. Hi, my name's Jane Goodall and I'm procurement manager specialising in the purchase of temporary staff. Our project saw the implementation of a collaborative bank across three NHS trusts within Hertfordshire. We worked in partnership cross sector with NHSP as our outsourced bank provider, but also multiple agencies providing workforce, temporary workforce. 
Some of the benefits of this project is it means that our, our colleagues can work right across a number of different organisations. We were asking our people not to work through agencies but and we were actually putting barriers up to stop that from happening. What this project did was to try to remove those barriers and so now any of our staff can work right across a number of different organisations, five different um, trusts um, across our ICS and that has real benefits for our um, staff but also massive benefits for ourselves. We saw a big done. reduction in agency spend and the usage of agency. We saw a big increase in bank fill and bank retention. We saw a good level of cost reduction and ultimately we saw an increase in the benefit to the patient in terms of patient experience. In judging the award for cross-sector working, yet again, the judging panel had a difficult decision. All the entries were of a high standard and I'd like to commend you all on the work you're doing cross-sectors. However, there can only be one winner and the judges felt that this project would have far-reaching impact on communities both within a regional area but also could be transposed across the rest of the UK on a national basis. So the judging panel were unanimous and the winner of the HPMA 2020 University of Bradford Cross Sector Working Award is Greater Manchester Health and Social Care Partnerships for their, their work on neighbourhood based blended roles. Well done to the team. I hope you enjoy celebrating. Congratulations.